the constitutionality of the Affordable Care Act depends not on public opinion of polls, but on legal precedent, which is well established. The President has spoken to this. Many, many legal sp scholars have spoken to it. Uh, several very prominent conservative jurists have uh, ruled uh, in favor of the constitutional constitutionality of the Affordable Care Act because uh, of their view of that precedent. The, the, the mandate, the individual mandate, uh, was a product of uh, a conservative think tank. It was adopted by many uh, leaders in the Republican Party in the 90s. It was adopted by and implemented by a Republican governor in Massachusetts. Uh, and while the president opposed it in the campaign, be, uh, he, in the process of crafting a health care reform bill in office, uh, was persuaded by uh, experts in the field uh, that it was the uh, best and most efficient way to ensure that we can uh, bring a large number of people uh, uh, into and under coverage, uh, getting insurance coverage, uh, and to allow for the uh, – to ensure that those with pre-existing <coughs> conditions get health care coverage. And that was the impulse behind it. Again, it's not about public opinion of polls. It's about policy.